We're in Mexico City and tonight we're going to do street photography in low light situations. And I'll try to break down how I do it in terms of camera settings and focal lengths and hopefully we'll get some cool photos. I hope you guys enjoy this. When I do street photography at night and what I suggest you should do too is I have a shutter speed around 125th of a second, have an aperture as fast as you can, so like 1.2, 1.4, 1.6, and then have an ISO between 2000 to 6000, somewhere around those lines. That's the only thing you need to know and then you need to go out and shoot. Amigo? Si, sí, perfecto. So I bought three different lenses so we can try different kinds of focal length. But the common uh, thing about these three lenses is that they're all prime lenses, which means usually that they can go a lot faster in terms of aperture. And when we go out and shoot in the streets, it's really key to have like an aperture around 1.2, 4 or 1.6 to get, let more light in and keep your ISO at like a decent level. We're going to start with the portrait lens, the 56 1.2. Then we're going to go to the 35 millimeter 1.4. And lastly, we're going to do a wide uh, angle lens of 16 millimeter 1.4. And yeah, then we have something to compare with. Yeah, <laughs> Jesus, nice. Perdón, amigo. ¿Puedo tomar una foto? ¿De ti? Yo fotografía el gente de México. Ah, okay. ¿Está bien? ¿Con cigarro también? <laughs> y aquí. <laughs> sí. Perfecto. Muchas gracias. Federico, mucho gusto. ¿Perdón? ¿Una fotito? ¿Can I take a photo? Okay. Okay, now we're standing here trying to find some buses that will stand still and then we will use the focal length of 56mm 1.2 to use it like as a sniper. So yeah, let's see how it goes. Now we switch to the 35mm 1.4, which is probably my preferred lens for street photography. So we're going to be a little uh, closer to the subject, and yeah, let's see what we can do with it. Pardon? Can I take your photo? Yeah, photo. So uh, if you guys, yeah, you keep speaking this way. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, exactly. You look at me, you guys look at him. Muy bien. Where are you from? Dinamarca. Dinamarca. Pero yo vivo en México. Ah, ok. ¿Desde hace cuánto? Tres años. Tres años. Ajá, pero mi español es muy mal. <laughs> Gracias. Buenas noches. Perdón, tengo una pregunta. Yo fotografía al gente de México. ¿Puedo tomar una foto? Sí, mire. Hey, ahí va. <laughs> sí, exactamente. Perfecto. Muchas gracias, chicos. Buen día. I just lost this one. 
and I'm not sure if it's actually survived. It was a hard hit. Ah, oh, This is a really bad sign. Oh, yeah, it's done. Oh, wait, this one has a filter. So maybe it's just a filter I can hear. Okay, this is great. I, I was 100% sure that this lens was out. Look at this one. Like it's completely trashed. And this one. Oh my God. So lucky. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> That's why you buy UV filters. Perdón, amigo. ¿Puedo tomar una foto? Aquí, aquí. <laughs> Right now I'm trying to do a long exposure where we get some of these nice trailing lights with the wide angle lens. And it's the 16mm 1.4. And thanks to Fuji for giving me a little bit of discount on these lenses and supporting the channel. I appreciate it. And I put a link to Fujifilm Denmark's Instagram in the description. I'll make sure to do a whole video about this long exposure stuff because it requires a whole video for itself. But the 16 millimeter 1.4 is really nice for long exposure in like cityscapes. Perdón, amigo. Yo fotografía al gente de México. Puedo tomar una foto de ti? Okay, buen día. Perdón, chicos. Perdón. Puedo tomar una foto con con luz? Perfecto, chido, wey. Perdón, una foto aquí. <laughs> Aquí, <laughs> perfecto. Muchas gracias, amigo. This spot is a great spot. We have a lot of light, and when you do street photography at night, you want to like follow wherever there's light, where there's neon light, restaurants light, car lights, whatever light you can find, you're good. But you need some light. Puedo tomar una foto, chicos. ¿Está bien? <laughs> Gracias. Gracias. ¿Cómo te buscamos? Son 20 pesos. Uh, en mi YouTube canal. YouTube. A ver cuál. Es para Mozart. Ajá. Pero entonces. <laughs> Perfecto. Gracias. Gracias, chicos. Buenas noches. All right, guys, that's it for my street photography at night. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And in terms of like lens choice, I would probably prefer the 35 millimeter for the kind of photos that I take. But if you're into cityscapes or like architectural photography, the 16 millimeter might be the best choice for you. And if you're all about portraits, then the 56 1.2. But I put a link to all of them in the description below and I'll see you guys soon.